Dr. Nine TV. Teruskan menyokong Dr. Nine TV. Dr. Nine TV. And welcome back to my channel. So uh, we need to discuss uh, more detail on the project brief for the uh, course uh, CFT 1063, uh, which is the basic multimedia and web technology. So uh, we have discussed uh, earlier uh, why is this uh, course learning outcome? Okay, explain element of multimedia, demonstrate the ability to use this application for development of the project, and also develop or prepare a report. Okay, so this is this uh, are this uh, continuous assessment, which is the four components will be explained uh, already explained earlier in in uh, earlier video in the previous video, and then. Um, uh, Maybe we go uh, more details on this uh, ass assessment, uh, assessment for each uh, project or deliverables. Uh, uh, okay, the first one is assignment one. Uh, it's a group, uh, group assignment which carry about this uh, thirty percent of the assessment. So we we have to be this, this uh, title uh, will be a short video. Uh, so any short videos, I mean, uh, you have discussed with your team. Uh, and uh, try to uh, apply the skill and knowledge how to develop the video okay so maybe we can uh, maybe you use this uh, all the, the process of developing a video like storyboard and, and other things that uh, important and also the tools that you need when you de plan for the video development and uh, you can use the online video streaming website Okay, uh, you can publish uh, YouTube or any other uh, platform that, uh, that that can be uh, used uh, okay, to uh, present your project. And uh, submission will be uh, 18 December uh, 2020. So basically for, for video, I mean uh, the element of the multimedia must be combined into the video that you develop. Okay, uh, and uh, you need to present uh, okay the video in very in, in a good presentation and try to use these uh, other tools that help you uh, to develop the, the presentation and the video as well. Okay, and then uh, in this group, okay, in this uh, uh, assignment, you can use. Uh, any other tools that useful and that uh, capable for you to develop and produce the uh, website okay i mean to 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 produce this uh, video okay so so that 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 that's, that that's other thing okay uh, very important and also the the basic requirement uh, for this assignment uh, maybe you can start with the three to four people so maybe more that one depends on the group okay that one we can discuss later and duration within three to four minutes uh, okay uh, of the video okay excluding the end credit uh, maksud dia di sini uh, the video will be uh, three to four minutes and uh, Minimal resolution will be uh, 720p and maximum okay uh, 1080 okay and the format the recommended format will be in MP4 okay these are the, the latest uh, I mean format uh, that will be uh, acceptable uh, for for the industry and for the most of the platform that you want to publish. Uh. And then uh, uh, the subject will be uh, informative, uh, able to teach uh, a viewer something, places, method, and hobby. So you can, uh, you know, propose any subject that uh, give information. So uh, information uh, that will be informative. Uh, okay, uh, so other people can refer and can use that information to guide and to. Uh, learn okay okay try to avoid uh, drama teaser trailer and short film because uh, this is uh, we, we try to de develop the content that very useful and uh, very important so other people can refer uh, to your video okay and then uh, all group member must be taking part 
as a role uh, either as a actor as a writer voice narrator uh, host and camera operator okay editor or technician so student can use a traditional actor if required so uh, for in short maybe uh, the participation uh, participation on the student will be um, in group uh, so uh, we want to see the teamwork uh, so you have you have to define uh, each role okay uh, for the project and you can use either english and bahasa so other language also acceptable but you need to produce or you have to put the subtitle okay uh, for example when you when you watch a drama or movie they have subtitle okay at the bottom of the screen so 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 we need that Okay, use uh, combined element of multimedia such as audio, video, text, and simple graphic, and uh, no overlap subject. Huh? So uh, meaning here, uh, uh, the scope and topic for the project cannot be the same. Okay, cannot be the same, and uh, the assignment uh, you can refer for for the guideline and so on. So uh, some of the thing you need to read, and some of the thing I I have to explain. Okay, so uh, okay, so this is the, the example. Huh? The example on in YouTube, huh? in YouTube. Okay, okay, okay. So this is the example when you uh, you know, upload. Okay, to find the YouTube. But uh, first of all, you have to develop uh, the, the video dulu lah. Okay, and then this is uh, the uh, evaluation rubric. Uh, rubric ni uh, uh, the, the the scale the, the scale that we use to evaluate the project. Okay, for example, if you combine the element of the multimedia and web technology, okay, how how the combination level uh, that good? Okay, uh, so for example, uh, the worst you know, per quality. Uh, if the video is not have any of the element okay any of the element so of course when you develop the video you must have at least a video and audio so uh, so so you have to think of it so so we have to see the, the quality based on this rubric so uh, okay so for the excellent one 10 that means 10 marks Okay, video has all the required element of the multimedia with the combination of the simple animation and motion graphic element a good quality with less noise. Uh, so, maksudnya the, the, the quality are good lah. The quality of good. I mean, the quality of the video are good and the quality of the combination, the element will be nice. Okay. If the combination application are not good, will be lower. Okay. So, uh, so this is basically for the assignment number one. So assignment number two, okay, as an online portfolio website. That means uh, a website, okay. The first one is a video. The second one is a website. Also in group, huh? also in group. And then the website, uh, maybe you can use any uh, website builder tools. Huh? We can use. There's a lot of uh, tools that you can use actually. The uh, on the internet okay you can uh, that we call it this uh, the the club based application so you can uh, register and you can use okay for for the time being you can use the, the free account lah. okay uh, so maybe if you want to need more function more features and uh, you need to pay for for the subscription okay so so that one is a choice lah, okay? for, for for this assignment you can use a free account that that's a that's a good enough Okay, depends on your your creativity how you want to develop the the, 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 the tools i mean how, how you are going to develop uh, the, the the website okay uh, depends on your creativity and then uh, and uh, you need to submit uh, the web link uh, when you develop the website you no know, the link you have to submit to the lecturer so that we know you are working okay on that particular website Okay, any updates or any uh, improvement that you made every week we can monitor so, so that's uh, important and uh, some uh, following are some of the basic uh, requirement uh, uh, for for us to refer when you want to uh, know execute or want to do this project okay the first one using uh, uh, subject who are related to the assignment one that mean uh, 
it's a, a similar subject with this uh, video so so that you can use that content of the video and upload it into a website okay 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 right and then number two uh, member will be three to four people so can be more uh, maybe we can discuss uh, and finalize later during the class so you want to see uh, how many students in, in the tutorial group and how many students that we be register in the class so we know uh, what the exactly the number that's suitable okay for the number of group and then um, we are recommend uh, the same group uh, will be uh, in the same group that you created during uh, assignment one to be this uh, I mean uh, the same group for this uh, assignment two so you they have some uh, uh, similarity on the on the subject uh, that you study and the project that you uh, deliver okay so next number three uh, contain at least the following item that that mean in your portfolio you mean uh, I mean the online portfolio at least uh, at least you must have all these uh, following you know following items uh, following information okay for example here a brief of your subject that mean the subject of your website so maybe you can come up with uh, like like the the company website you have your team okay you have uh, some subject i mean uh, vision and so on and what the subject that related Okay, that, that that you uh, want to uh, prepare, huh? and then tutorial research. So before you do uh, your your portfolio, I mean uh, the video and so on, uh, you must, you uh, know, explain the research process. I mean the tutorial of the research. Okay, what are the uh, study uh, that you conducted uh, in order for you to to find out the information, the knowledge, and the tools that you use in developing the website and also produce the uh, multimedia uh, product okay and uh, concept map a breakdown into script oh, so that one the, the structure lah. that mean i want to see the, the, the structure of the uh, of the map i mean the navigation no okay navigation of the the other uh, button lah. okay the design so that one that will be uh, explained later in the in the class Okay, and then uh, next one will be uh, development process. Huh? Okay, development process for the video. Okay, when you have uh, your video, you you have to record uh, the systematic process in your production. So this is the process uh, how you develop or prepare the the video. Uh, we want to understand how you are doing. Okay, how you produce the project. Okay, step by step. Okay, start from pre-production. Okay, what 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 you do in pre-production? Maybe you do a research. Okay, you do some observation and so on. And then production. Okay, what are the tools that you use? And uh, what are the technique that you apply in your production? Okay, and post-production maybe you want to test lah. I mean the 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 how how good your product. Okay. And uh, also uh, in your website, you also uh, need to have some uh, footage, uh, footage that means some video or images, okay, behind the scene. Uh, so it shows that uh, the the like a diary, you know, no, not 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 a diary. Uh, so maybe uh, behind the scene, uh, when you do the the project, what are the activity that involve during the production? What are the activity during pre-production? What are the activity for the post-production? This means to tell a story about the be the behind the scene of your successful project okay uh, because now you know uh, every time you do you sometimes you take pictures you take video you post to the social media now you take picture uh, and you take uh, video okay you uh, upload on your online portfolio website i think it sounds clear huh? okay Okay, and then uh, you also need to have a content such a role of your group member. Okay, for example, that uh, in your website portfolio, maybe uh, as I said earlier, okay, they have a, a group, uh, a group name, you know, and the member, okay, member name of the group. 
Okay And their roles uh, Their roles What they are doing uh. I mean for example uh, uh, One uh, member Do a production Okay One member Do A task On storyboard Okay Another member Focus on the audio Visual And another one Focus on managing The, the whole project So Like uh, uh, They have some position uh, They mean they, Their roles Uh, and function uh, uh, for each member that contribute to the successful of the project. Okay, uh, I think it's clear. And then uh, link of the video. Okay, uh, link of the video on your website portfolio. Okay, video that you produce. You may use, uh, may develop uh, other uh, additional video. For ex for example, you want to explain about yourself. Okay, about yourself About uh, your uh, personal I mean uh, Each of the team member in the group you know? Maybe like a video CV you know? uh, Very simple okay? uh, Just explain about yourself What your interest And what your skill And what is your role in the project Okay And then uh, maybe your your expectation lah. Maybe uh, the way I mean your expectation eh, When you learn all this and so on Okay And then student uh, need also to apply fundamental of interactivity such as a simple minimal uh, graphical interface. Okay, at least uh, three link outside the source. Uh, for example, this one uh, uh, when you have a page for your website, okay, you have to demonstrate the hyperlink. Okay? Hyperlink here means uh, when you click one page, okay, go to the next page. Okay, they have uh, interactivity, and when you click Not that and the second page you have to move back to the previous page you can click so all this button okay uh, you have to uh, develop okay okay and then um, at least two pages of the website or oh, this one uh, very minimum huh? so uh, I don't want to set a limit huh, for the pages of your website but it depends on your creativity okay uh, because uh, When we see nowadays uh, the the new type of website, sometimes uh, you have to follow the current trend, how they design the website. So I want to see uh, your website will be a fresh website, okay, not like plain website like uh, 10 years ago. Okay, I want to see your website will be the latest uh, design and the latest, you know, uh, using the latest technology, video, audio, and etc. And then uh, there's other uh, the, what 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 I want to see here is your creativity, okay, and the, the uniqueness of your portfolio, how you present your portfolio in uh, in uh, in your project, okay, both uh, you can use your any your creativity and uh, I, I for sure uh, all the student they have their own creativity and I know you can do it, okay, and uh, okay make sure. Okay, no overlap subject. Okay, uh, I, I mean here, uh, you cannot do the same project. I mean, uh, each group have to do different project. Okay, it sounds clear. Okay, and then student must make sure that website can be viewed in various platform. Okay, uh, either in laptop, tablets, and mobile phones. That mean you must have a certain uh, standard of consistency. Okay, consistency of the layout of your website. Okay, I, I want, I, 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 I mean, um, I want to see the flexibility of your website to accommodate with different types of uh, hardware and software. Okay, maybe when you uh, use, uh, you know, a different platform or different hardware, uh, the layout and the design will be. Uh, little bit different but try to accommodate with these uh, differences okay okay this is uh, the, the, the the scale of uh, rubric evaluation so uh, it's similar with the, the the first assignment but the weightage uh, of the mark will be 20% only okay they want 30% so we are we are using how good you are using the Uh, knowledge okay and the basic understanding about the website and also the multimedia and also how 
your reports eh? I mean uh, how systematic is your reports and how uh, clear your report okay and how good your explanation in the report so this uh, depends on uh, the if you present good report with a systematic way you might you might have get a higher grade or, or higher score but if your reports are uh, not clear okay if your reports are not consistent if your if your reports are not uh, clearly enough so for sure the the, the score are lit, a, a little bit low so 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 it's depend it's, it's your own choice and it's your own decision okay okay next the test uh, test okay test will be uh, uh, maybe like like uh, uh, a small uh, test uh, maybe like like a quiz and, and maybe uh, uh, I, I'm not sure yet but maybe most probably we are using like a quiz uh, about uh, 20 question uh. okay we are using Google Docs or any other uh, platform that we can do assessment through uh, online platform okay uh, it's about 20% of the total marks uh. so basically uh, this assessment we focus on how uh, you demonstrate your understanding eh? and what is your knowledge about uh, web technology and also the uh, multimedia technology okay the basic concept the multimedia and and other related technology that form the internet and the form the web technology okay finally uh, the, the last assessment uh, for these uh, courses uh, basic multimedia and web technology CFT 1063 will be the final presentation okay uh, with a 30% of this uh, weightage uh, for the assessment so the focus on final presentation and product demonstration so it shows that when you have your your website how you present your website so we want to see how you communicate with these uh, other people uh, uh, that you want to promote okay your product and your website Okay, two things the presentation. One product, a multimedia, and another one is a, a multimedia web. So two uh, product, a project that you need to present during the final presentation. So don't worry, this is a in group. So you have to plan, you have to manage by your own team. Okay, so you can use a video streaming website. Okay, uh, so you can uh, upload direct to the video streaming website, or you can upload your website okay so because now uh, basically uh, okay then so no, normally we are the presentation will be uh, face to face but uh, due to this uh, limitation of this uh, no, COVID-19 uh, uh, situation now uh, so we cannot conduct the face to face but we need to we can conduct face to face also but using the online platform so i, I try to, to think something uh, easier for you so maybe uh, you can prepare a video and so we can evaluate through a video and uh, so that that that's other thing that really importance uh, and then uh, for for the project brief okay and then uh, in this presentation will be four to three members student need to record and uh, present uh, and look like a professional presentation and uh, must be uh, according to this uh, online portfolio okay and uh, the most student need to effectively present the following content uh, we are focusing on the uh, brief intro about both of your product okay you you, you able to to pitch yeah to pitch and to to uh, brief introduction of the website and introduction of the multimedia product and step by step development okay for the video and the for, for the website a role for each member okay and what you have learned from this course okay the some summary lah okay and then uh, student uh, do not have to run playback of your assignment during the presentation. Okay, so so it meaning that uh, uh, you just briefly present what you have. Okay, 
and then uh, another things that are really important for the student to be focused on communication, creativity, and pro, uh, professionalism. So this is other three things that uh, we focus on this uh, evaluation. Okay, I mean here for final presentation, we focus on how good your communication, eh? and how good your creativity and how professional okay you deliver the presentation okay and then uh, i think i have explained a lot okay about the project brief so i hope this will be help you to come up with a very good assignment a very good project so i wish you all good luck and all the best and uh, hopefully uh, we we'll see you again in another video so thank you very much assalamualaikum and all the best dr 9 tv teruskan menyokong dr 9 tv dr 9 tv